Those aren't Navy SEALs. Those is not a BUDS class. Those are sea cadets. And how do I know that? Because I started the very first SEAL Sea Cadet training program, Boy Scouts in the Navy that aspire to be SEALs at SEAL Team 2 in 1992. I don't know. There's just a group of people that took a picture, and I was in the picture. Yeah. That's all I know. I don't know. There's only two of us in that picture. Like I said, myself and a guy by the name of Eric Neal. You just said it was a there. Bud Zendok picture. So is that well, ringing I mean, any I, bells I, now that those are just Boy Scouts that attended two weeks of summer training with Team One? That's all. Well, so you're telling me those are Boy Scouts or Team yes. Scouts? Yes. Okay. Well, I didn't know that. I, I didn't know any of that. I thought right? it was your Bud Zendok picture. You see where this okay, is going, sure. Jason? Oh, you know, I don't... Oh, what the, huh? Say that again? You see where this is going, Jason? Where's it going? That, you know, I'm not the guy that just makes random phone calls when somebody fires some shit out. That was supposed to be a Team 3 picture because you had Team 3 on that plaque. Well, that's clearly Team 1. 1 is just obscured. And I sent back the clarification and I said, those are fucking sea cadets. That's not a Bud's class. They're Boy Scouts. I, but I never claimed that that was my SEAL team class. No. Because I did not graduate Bud. You said your your Bud Zendok class and took a picture in front of Team One. That's what you just there's said. Bud's, okay, Eric Neal and I are out there for Bud Zendok before we got it, before Team Two, well, before 218 started. We took a picture with a group of people, and that, I, I, I came across that in my old photos. And how long do you figure you were at Buds before that photo got taken? You know, I don't know. I, that's what I was trying to remember. Just I, jumped in. Probably, a, just jumped in a. Sir? Just jumped in a picture with a bunch of guys standing in front of Team One's plaque. Just said, "Oh, yeah, there's a photo that? op. I'll just jump in that thing with Neil." Yeah, that's, that's probably that's probably all it was. You know, Don, it was so long ago. Yeah. To be honest with you, I don't remember. I got an honorable discharge and I came home. Yeah, I know that. Okay, I think that's the only bit of shit out of this whole thing that I believe. Sounds like some dramatic stuff, and to uh, to go in, I can review all this. But again, I'm just not the guy yeah. that just picks up the phone and just calls because somebody does that. I have your records. I know you got out after six months and 15 days. You were discharged as an E2. I know you were in that class. And... Uh, yeah. I know that was so, sent so, hold on, hold on. as part so of your you budget. Well, you know, I, I, I can't. So you said I was in that class, two eighteen. Yeah, I'm figuring you are. I see yeah. your service records. You were discharged from uh, Naval Special Warfare Center after six months and fifteen days of service as need two. Yeah, I'm trying to re Sir? recall all of this stuff here, but oh, uh, I know. I'm I know. pretty clear that Forgive that me. picture was back there. That that was. Uh, labeled as your Bud's class picture, that that's what you told. And I've, I've got yeah, an well, email no, that it, you sent it, out to all those was, guys claiming that you were an HM1 and you were quoting Mark Lee's letter. And you were telling people yeah, some was, bullshit on Memorial no, Day. That was all part of this smoke and yeah. mirrors? Absolutely, because I wanted to, I wanted to prove, to the, more so the president of my company, that, that she is a, a bad chink in the armor in the place and that she claims that she's all good at tissues, and I, pro I proved her, I proved to him that, that she's not. Yeah, okay? you proved so, to him. What do you think would happen if I called him and talked to him? What do you think would happen then? And what do you think would happen if I called that guy and told him what I believe is fact? You might have been able to bullshit him, but who in the fuck goes right. to the lengths of buying a paddle, putting that Team 3 on it, calling yourself an HM1, labeling the Bud's class, putting this behind it, signing emails that you're an HM1, sending them out, seems to be the company, and quoting Mark Lee, and that you write in there that I was a SEAL. Yeah. That, all to smoke somebody out, and you are just telling me a bunch of bullshit about this being your fucking Bud's class, and it's a group of sea cadets. I tell you, Jason, you know, I'm the, you know, guys underestimate me, and they, they sit around for a little bit, and they stew, and they come up, and they go... You know what? I'll just tell that dumb fucking seal this shit and he'll believe it because he's a dumb fuck. I'm the guy that gets lied to from the minute I wake up in the morning to the minute I go to bed at night. You're just fucking insulting me 
with that. You didn't make it through Bud's, but you sure as shit have been helping that uh, promotion uh, fucking bit of yours out there and telling everybody you were seeing. I don't believe a fucking word of it. How about that? You don't believe a word of what I'm telling you? No, not one. Not one. Well, I'm, I'm, they're claiming I'm to be a SEAL, an HM1, SEAL Team 3, you and Mark Lee, Chris Kyle, whoever the fuck else you're doubting out there. You didn't make it through, nope. buds, but that didn't stop you from uh, taking this to the next level with shit. And all this bullshit about trying to smoke out some girl. Yeah. Okay. I'm buying that one. Okay, well, hold on. Don. Don. Yeah. Here's the deal. That that is the truth. I was trying to smoke her out. Absolutely. Got any proof should of I, that? Should I have taken it? Should I have taken it to that extreme? You got any proof of that? You got some emails well, I, that you exchanged with your boss telling him this master plan of yours. You got anything? Anything from anyone else that you can just show me here? This is what I told Bob the master plan, and I told him this in September. Anything like that? No, his name is Randy Zacek. You know what? Don't about. don't start spinning me in circles. You know what I mean. Like, no, no, no. I'm not. I'm spinning in any circle. I'm just, it's it's just you and I talking, and I'm trying to tell you the truth. Yeah. And I have nothing to hide. You got any proof of that that you were smoking this chick out? Why 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 would I want to have proof that I'm trying to smoke the chick out to the president of the company? I'm talking about anybody, anybody except you in on this master plan of yours to smoke her out. Or are you just telling me uh, this I, was the plan and now I'm good with the boss because, you know, I knew she was problem. No. There, there's no need, there, there was no need for me to tell anybody that I was smoking her out. Why would you, why would you choose SEAL? Why would you go to you the know, lengths I, of getting a, a paddle, Team 3, well, posting I, I think, pictures and I writing emails? Thing, I think the main thing was is that, is that it was something that I knew quite a bit about because I had been to Buzz. Not finished, Buzz, but I'd been to Buzz, and it was something that I could be convincing about, and, and it was something that I knew she would buy on. That's why I was. That's why I did that. It was it wrong, Don? Yes, sir. It was absolutely. And like I said, um, it was never meant to uh, falsify, and that's not what I was trying to do. I was trying to get her to buy, and she did buy. So I, you know, and I'm the one that called you back. Oh yeah. So it's not like I'm lying oh, to hey. anybody. Hey, 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 Jason, you know, this, yeah. is, this is like, you know, when you go into a car dealership and you, you know, you say, well, I'll think about it and come back, you know, and you tell the guy, when you have no intention, because that car dealer hears that shit day in and day out, oh, exactly. oh, I'm going to think about it and come back. And the amount of calls that I get back from you guys after doing that, because you've had a chance to think about it and you figure a way out of this shit and then you call me back like I'm some dumbass and I'm going to buy off on that story. You know, every every bit about your stuff after all that. I got an email from a guy. I guess I've been doing this, verifying these things for 12 years now. 12 years, okay. the volume that I go through. And you'd be surprised at how many guys just tell the same fucking story. There's just no originality into it. I'll think up some shit, and oh. that dumb fucking Shipley will buy it. Because I, I can only put imagine. some thought into it. Yeah, well, this is one of them. I ain't buying none of it, Jason. Is there anything else, bro? I can go back to my old lady. Oh. Well, okay, well, I wasn't trying to get you to buy anything. I was just trying to explain myself as yeah. to why I did what I did. Yeah, okay, so, dude. I never, but I never published that I was, and I never will because I wasn't. 